hey guys good morning so today is actually my birthday i'm turning 28 i know i'm freaking old but it is what it is um so i just wanted to vlog so today we're just gonna go out to eat today is the thursday march 25th um we're actually just going out to eat and then just go to the mall in fresno we're really not gonna do much because we already have plans for the weekend we're actually gonna go to la we already booked a hotel for Saturday, and then Babe still has to book a hotel for Friday, right, babe? Um, she's over there brushing her teeth. Don't mind me. I just woke up, you guys. Like, oh my god, I was so tired. And, um, but yeah, you guys, I'm just gonna bring you guys with us and just vlog, you know, because I haven't been like vlogging or doing any videos for you guys. So I just was thinking to just vlog for you guys. So this video is just gonna go like from today and then like tomorrow we leave to LA, which is Friday. And I'll just be vlogging like during the days. But yeah, you guys, oh, and look at my nails. I finally have nails, guys. I'm so freaking hyped. They look so bomb. Let me see, don't mind the mess in the back. But this is how they look, my birthday nails. I'm so happy because I had four months, you guys, four months without having nails. And then now that I have them, I feel like a bad bitch. Like, you know, like, oh, my fucking head hurts. Like, oh, you know, showing off my nose. Like, oh, babe. Ew, you guys don't mind her in the back. She's being so nasty right now, brushing her teeth. I can't do stuff like that. Like, no, it's gross. But anyways, um, right now I'm just gonna wash my face, um, cleanse my face and stuff like that and put my skincare. And then I'll just see you guys right back once I'm done doing all of that. And then I'm start getting ready. All right, you guys. So I just wanted to show you guys my outfit for the day. So I'm wearing this cute little dress that I got from Forever 21 for $9 plus my 30% off. You know, I had to get it. And then this cute jean jacket, my high heels, this cute little hat that I got from Forever 21 as well. So yeah, you guys, this is just basically the fit that I'm gonna be wearing today. Nothing crazy. I'm letting that for the weekend when we go to LA. But yeah, I just wanna show you guys my fit. Super cute and casual. But yeah, you guys, we're ready and we're gonna head out. All right, you guys, so we are out in the bar already. I'm just waiting for Lucero to come back in the car. Um, right now, uh, we're just right here at Taco Bell. We came to grab something really quick because we are going to Fresno. We're already kind of hungry. And I'm pretty sad, you guys, because the kids weren't able to um, come with us because they do have school, and I do not want them to miss school. And um, especially because Haley's been having a lot of trouble with um, reading and stuff like that, so I, it wasn't a good idea for her to miss school. But yeah, I'm super sad because of that because they're always with me and Lucero all the time, so it kind of feels weird that they're not with me, but um, I just want Haley to learn more and i don't i didn't think it was a good idea for them to miss school so i mean that's why we're just doing everything so early because right now it's like 11 something that we would when like later on they get off school they could just be with us but yeah you guys anyways um i was so undecided to wear this hat or not but lucero because i had asked lucero should i keep it on or all because i wasn't feeling my hair today and she's like no just take it off and i was like nah hell no i like it on you know so I put it on IG and you guys let me know and you guys told me to keep it on. So I left it on because it's super cute. And this is a dress that I got. It's a cute little dress that I got from Forever 21. And the hat as well. I think I told you guys that earlier, but I'll let you guys know again. But yeah, you guys, this is how my makeup came out. It's super cute. And this is why I hate acne, you guys, because I hate when like it looks like this. But my, my skin been doing really good right now. It's super, super good. But it's just that pimple that decided to come out and fuck shit up. But who cares? It don't really matter. But yeah, you guys, right now I'm just waiting on Lucero and I'll start vlogging whenever we get to Fresno. Because I want the cheese factory. So that's where we're going. So yeah. You guys, Lucero's gonna end up freaking killing me because she's eating and driving and I hate that she does stuff like this, especially when she's in her phone. I hate when she's on her freaking phone and I always have to tell her to stop being on her phone. I can't look at the time because even that kills her. Yes, like, dude, you never know it like any little second. Anything can happen in any, any little like, second. Well, you know, I'm just trying to look at the time. 
still you never know but yeah you guys um i just wanted to let you guys know and for all of those that are following my business i just want to say thank you so much for supporting me and especially for those that purchase something from my business i just want to say thank you so freaking much it means the world to me you guys don't even know how happy you guys make me um it was something really hard for me to start like my my business and um i for sure thought that i was wasn't gonna get any orders and i was even telling lucero like dude like i'm scared that i don't get any orders at all and she just told me you know it takes time to grow and stuff like that and i understand that but i was kind of scared you guys i was low-key freaking scared and i was like dude like that's embarrassing like if i don't get no any orders but you guys been so freaking supporting me and i'm so freaking happy that you guys ride with me and then you guys you know buy stuff with your own money just to you know support me as well that makes me so happy and i love you guys so freaking much and i put a lot of money into my business that i never thought i was gonna do something like this sorry my my hand is all moving because of the car i never thought that i was gonna do something like this and that i was gonna get through it and i actually really did you guys and i'm so freaking proud of myself but yeah i just wanted to tell you guys thank you so much for supporting me and for those that bought stuff from me it means so much to me and i love you guys so much but yeah you guys what do you what do you think babe what do you think about my business um i think your senior dress is really sexy and um I think there'd be girls that would want to buy what she wears. I think she knows or she, or she has an eye for fashion and um, she does look for good quality material and I, I believe in her business. Um, if I would look sexy in it, I mean, I would buy it. <laughs> Period. I, I, would, I would rock those dresses. You don't even know. I, 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 I know I'd pull a couple people, but... Um, that's just not for me but for the ones that do like being really girly i mean um i encourage you to check out her website shop Haley's uh boutique yes um, support your girl man um i'm extremely proud of her and um yep. i just wish you the best within these Thank next you, couple Thank years you, so you know much. but yeah you guys that's what she oh, thinks and happy birthday baby i love you thank you babe i love you too but yeah, you guys, so I just want to say thank you so much. I can't be vlogging too much because I want to vlog like today and then like when we go to LA. So yeah, I'm actually going to LA tomorrow and I'm going to go purchase some more um, inventory because I haven't went in uh, like maybe like in three weeks, huh? Just because I haven't had time, you guys. So um, tomorrow we're leaving and that day I'm going to dedicate that day for my business. I know I... I, I don't supposed to be doing this because it's my birthday, but I just want to, you know, get some stuff that I need to for my business because I need to be, you know, keep going and I can't be lagging it. So yeah, you guys, and we'll see you guys in a bit. So you guys, we're here at the cheese factory. So I think I'm gonna get like a pasta. I think it's called a four cheese pasta. Um, I want that one. I tried another pasta last time. These are the second, our second time coming. We came here on Valentine's Day, right? So this is our second time coming and I want to get another pasta. The first pasta that I got was alright, but I want to try the four cheese pasta. And then, what are you going to get, babe? I think it's like a spaghetti. Spaghetti. Pasta? Yeah, it's a pasta. And then last time I got, it was the fried mac and cheese. Um, they're like a little like bolas i'm gonna show you guys right now like a little ball they're super freaking good you guys so i we got that and then last time we settled got the cucumber what was it the fried cucumber fried, fried i mean zucchini. the fried zucchini cool cucumbers the fried zucchinis and those were so good as well so once our food gets here you guys i'm gonna show you guys because it's so freaking bomb and then we actually get some bread too and then my drink is uh, raspberry lemonade. It's so good as well. And then Lucy got that drink. It tastes like a tea and a lemonade. Like that. that one's really good too. But the only thing that I mind is kind of sour. I I don't really like sour stuff, but I'm still gonna drink it. But yeah, you guys, I'm gonna show you guys once we get our food, and it's gonna be so delicious. 
How are you guys? So we got our appetizers and these are the mac and cheese that I'm telling you guys. These are fire, like fire. And then we have the, what are they called again? Fried zucchinis. Yeah, the fried zucchinis with some ranch. Mm, so good. But let me just go like this so you guys can see. Look at how bomb. Look at that. Look at that, you guys. It's so good. My mouth is watery. And then with the sauce right here. Mm, so good. All right, you guys. So this is the pasta that I got. It's, the, it's called the four cheese pasta. It looks super good. I don't know about all that right there. I'm gonna take that off, but <laughs> the pasta looks bomb. And then that's this is play. Why are you laughing? I don't know what that big one chunk of, but I, I'm gonna try it and see how it tastes. But yeah, we're just gonna enjoy our food and we'll see you guys in a bit. You guys, oh my fucking gosh. I know you could see it. I know you could fucking see that in the fucking bag. So Earlier in the morning, as you guys know, we went to go eat the cheese factory. I was telling Haley she wanted to eat with me my leftovers. And when I was taking the fucking plate out the bag, bro, like what the fuck? This is what the fuck I seen in the bag. What the fuck is this? This is fucking disgusting. I'm so fucking pissed. Like, I don't even know what to say, you guys. Like, I'm shook. I'm so fucking shook. Like, oh my God. Never again. Never fucking again. Hey, guys. Good morning. It's the next day. It's Friday. I'm here with Faye. Um, we are here in LA already. We only need how many minutes to get to where we need to go? About 40. 40 minutes to get to our destination, which is going to be where I buy my stuff for my boutique. So I'm just gonna show you guys around whenever we get there. That way you guys can see a little bit of where I go and stuff like that. And if you guys are planning to start your business, you guys should do it. Um, it's kind of hard, I'm not gonna lie, it's hard. And I'm, I'm still like learning, but if you wanna do something and you wanna start a business, go ahead and do it. But right here where I go to, you, you do have to have a permit. So make sure you have a permit. Um, just a reminder, a permit is free, you guys. Yes. You want to start a small business, just fill out the paperwork and it's free. It's free, you guys. Um, I actually went with um, somebody to go help me do my paperwork and everything because we didn't want to do it on ourselves and end up messing up on some stuff or questions and stuff like that. So we went and paid to, to get some help. But anyways, you guys... I know you guys seen the video of what happened to me when I got the stuff from my food or when I was taking off the boxes from the from the bag. You guys, that was so disgusting. And actually, Lucero wasn't in the house when that happened. She was running some errands and I called her and I showed her on FaceTime and she was so pissed as well, you guys. It's crazy because um, once we went to the to the restaurant it was I like I felt this vibe I felt like it was just crazy you guys first when I got there this lady that was helping us to, like to set to set us to set us how do you say it uh, us. To see, set us now? I don't know you know what I mean but we don't know how to speak but um she freaking stared at me from head to toe like she couldn't keep her eyes off me you guys and like kind of was getting me mad because I was just like down like 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 you could look at me once but don't be staring at me vicious and like it, it, it kind of got me mad but i didn't say nothing about it but i did tell lucero like dude did you see how she was staring at me so that happened and then when she was gonna set me down because lucero went to go get her phone in the car so she, i went and she sat me down she was like oh my god um just be careful you don't fall and i was just like dude like i know how to walk in heels like you don't have to tell me what to do or what what well, what's gonna happen to me you know because i i know i'm good at walking in heels <laughs> so that happened to me and then we were basically just getting like really stared down when we got there um, yeah i don't know if it's because we just look really fancy fancy huh nah but, but um, maybe i don't know it was just weird and then when i got sat down um the lady that was the one that helped us with our food and everything her vibe was just off you guys like i even told lucero like when she came back from the car 
I just told her like dude this lady is just fucking weird like I just didn't like her vibe you guys period and what is weird to me was every time we go to restaurants I don't know if, if it's everywhere else or not but if, especially Olive Garden when we go to Olive Garden they don't pack our food right we have to pack it so yesterday when she brought us our boxes we asked for boxing boxes for the food to take it back home we boxed them up and then she's like oh i'm gonna go get the bags right babe she went to she said that she was gonna go get the bags yeah she's gonna go get her bags and um you know you would think she would give us the bag but for us to pack it but she didn't give it to us she took our plates and she put it in the bag um which was a, i thought was a little strange but i mean whatever you want to put my food in the bag exactly we were just like you know right like she wants to pack our stuff you know and put it in the in the bag and lucero was just telling me that whenever she was coming back with the bags that the bags you know how sometimes you have to like go like this to the bag so they could open the bags kind of come sealed wherever you go it doesn't yeah. matter where you go the bags are always sealed but when she was coming you could kind of see like the bag was open like they open the bag and um i mean if something's in there you're gonna obviously feel that way and, yes. know, and be like okay there's something in here but we didn't notice nothing weird or awkward until we got home until we got home you guys Dude, the food was so fire it was so we good to eat it so bad when we got home yeah i was just like down i told him like you know what like you can share my pasta with me it's really good or whatever and i was already heating up my pasta but when i was taking out this other stuff that's when i seen that freaking chicken i don't know what it is chicken bird i don't freaking know but you guys i felt so disgusted and i was so mad lucero actually did call them and let them know and complain and gave the ladies name and everything you guys and they basically didn't even do anything um i called them because i mean with this whole covid stuff you never really know what you can be exposed to and i almost felt like it was done to us like intentionally yeah like if she purposely put it there you guys I mean, when i tell you that her vibe was weird like her vibe was freaking weird like i mean it, it sounds kind of crazy that we're gonna get home and have a fucking bird or a freaking our, chicken i don't know i don't know what was a little blood. baby chicken uh, uh, it was a dead bird in, in her bag and then the crazy thing is that she packed our stuff you guys like she had to see that fucking thing inside there like there's no when way she did it bag and you're gonna put something in there i mean obviously you can see it exactly right but i mean we didn't get a chance to see because she was the one that wanted to put her stuff in the bag yeah and um it's just really disturbing we had to clean and disinfect anything that that we put that was exposed to that bird or the plate we threw everything um, in the trash we didn't even eat our food because i was just that. disgusted that whole day like like that night i didn't even eat anything you guys because i was just disgusted to my like in my stomach like i just felt nasty and um the cheese factor all they had to really just say was that they were sorry that's all they said i, I didn't guys. even ask them for my money back i didn't ask them for nothing i just told them like you know what like this is like a health hazard issue like this shouldn't be happening to me or to anybody and i gave them the the lady's name and, and my bill number um i didn't have nothing against the lady but i did kind of feel like the lady maybe had something against us um you could kind of feel certain vibes like that off of people i felt it right away and um it's it's sad that we have to think like this and in, in these times and in, in this kind of world but I mean, that could have been some kind of harm towards me and Yesenia and, yeah. and we my didn't kids, want to take no chances, my kids so we're just fucking them. threw all the food away. Yeah. So basically, you guys, that what happened to us yesterday, it was just disgusting. I was mad. I was pissed. I just couldn't believe it. And yeah, that's what happened to us yesterday. But right now, we just on our way to our destination. And whenever we get there, I'll start vlogging. All right, you guys, so I'm just gonna show you guys a little bit of the places that I come to. This is called San Pedro in LA. And there's a lot of stores here, you guys, a lot of stores. I swear to you, like, in a day, I can't even go through all of these. But 
Yeah, this is basically what is is all that. I'm excited to buy inventory. Sometimes I stress because I don't know what you guys like or what you guys want to see. So today I'm just going to buy stuff that aren't um, trending or like they're in, like, you know, for spring and stuff like that. So I'm just going to try to bring that in for you guys. So yeah, this is basically what I'm doing right now. Right now we're actually going to go straight to go eat because we haven't ate since we got here. So we're going to go eat really quick and then from there I'm going to start looking around because I'm hungry and I need to eat something. Oh, babe. Ass. Shut up. So yeah, you guys, right now I'm going to show you guys where we go eat. That way you guys can see. Um, every time we come here, we stop at this taco place and it's pretty bomb. So I'm going to show you guys right now in a bit. Okay, basically this is the place that we come eat. I'm kind of embarrassed to go over there and vlog for you guys. But yeah, we always come here and we always eat right here. And the food is pretty freaking good. So I got a hot dog, two tacos de pollo. And then Lucero got five de pollo, huh? Yeah. I'm gonna eat because I'm hungry and I was waiting for my tacos. I already got my hot dog, but I wanted a vlog for you guys, so yes. This is a big ass mirror. It's the mirror for me. So we got here to our destination, our hotel. We just booked in right now. We settled just in the back, sanitizing everything as usual. But um, you guys were so exhausted. We were um, checking out my stuff for my business and it was nothing but freaking walking and we're hella exhaust exhausted. Right now we're like in Santa Monica. We actually wanted to go like to the beach and just walk around or whatever, but we're just gonna rest for a little bit because you guys were so tired. Um, our legs hurt. We're just trying to have a little bit of rest and then try to see if we could find something to eat. But right now I'm gonna show you guys how the room looks. It's super cute. It gives me like, um, it gives me like, what is that word called? Like cabinet, what is it called? Cabin, cabin vibe. Yeah, cabin vibe. Now I can never talk, dude. But yeah, it, it, it's that kind of little vibe, you know? Right now, I'll show you guys the room, but I'm holding all of this. I'm waiting for the little to just sanitize everything so I can put it away. All right, so right here is the entrance, of course. And then this is how the room looks. I love that they have this big old ass mirror. And then you walk in right here, and then you see the restroom, super freaking cute. You know, we need the separate restroom here. This is gonna be right here in the morning, for sure. And then this is me. I look like shit, don't mind me. But it looks super cute, you guys, I love it. Look at how cute. So, this is the restroom. And then this is just our room, our king bed. And yeah, this is a cute room for us. Just for me and Lucy, we're gonna be doing our thing, right babe? Yeah. And then this is our view. This is how it looks, super cute. And then Lucy's gonna go right now to go get some free wine, right? It's free wine and what else? Yes. 
Yeah, she's gonna go and get some. I mean, I don't drink, so yeah. That's was basically what we're gonna do right now. We're just gonna chill, rest, and um, you shower. I'm just gonna shower my body or whatever. It's super cute, huh? But yeah, you guys, we're, we're gonna just settle in and we'll check up on you guys in a bit. We just came to get a settle's face mask. She forgot to get it, but right now we're just gonna head to the lobby so the settle could get her wine. She wants to drink a little bit of wine. Hopefully it's good. What did he say it was, it was called? Something Santa Monica or something? I have no idea. We have a couple drinks. I think that's what he said. Um, but we're just gonna do that. And then I'm just gonna show you guys how it looks. It's super cute. I like it. It even gave me like little vibes for me to get ready in the morning and take some pictures. But I don't know if I want to get ready in the morning because I, we're gonna go out to dinner in the in the night. In the night or in the, in the afternoon we're going to dinner. Lucero just still has to look for a place to go eat. You guys, I've been telling her since the longest, uh, and she ew, that's just smell. <laughs> <laughs> ew, get away from me! <laughs> I'm trying to get away from you. <laughs> Oh, it smells like malgas. But um, I forgot what I was saying. You see, interrupting me. By that smell. So right now we're just gonna do that real quick, and then the show is poison. I'll show you guys um the little vibes we have going on right now. Imagine we get stuck. <laughs> I feel so weird. I hate coming through this thing. But where is it at? Okay. I'm kind of embarrassed. Hold on, you guys. So this is how it looks. Super cute. Cute, it looks so cute outside. Like over there, I want to take some pictures over there, looking cute or whatever. But yeah, basically, this is the vibes, you guys. I'm talking low because I'm embarrassed. Look at Lucero, look at Lucero being an alcoholic. Took the whole bottle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I'm fine. I don't drink. Thank you. Taste test. What do you think? Yeah, um, I'll get ice. Hasta quiere ice? Why it's kind of hot? Tell me the truth. Tell me the truth of the taste. Yeah. Don't lie. You ain't got to lie. Yeah, it's kind of hot. Yeah, it's kind of hot. Yeah. Why it smells nasty? It tastes like. Like podrido grapes. <laughs> You're drinking some podrido ass freaking grapes. Yeah, it smells like um, like grape podrido, and then like I don't know, just weird. That's just strong. That just smells hella strong. But we're just right here with the vines. You guys, Lucero broke my freaking tripod again. Well, the first one was me, and then the second time was Lucero. So we're gonna go to Target, and she's gonna buy me a new one. So I'm just like vlogging with my hand, and it already hurts. But yeah, you're not hungry. I don't know where anywhere. Search up something up. Search up something up. Search something up. I low key have a headache, you guys. Like, I really feel really exhausted. I feel like all that walking and all that looking at the clothes and stuff like that, it just, it was overwhelmed. And I really didn't find a lot of stuff. Like, 
I still have to come next week to check it out again because I was just I was already done I was done for the day so right now we're just gonna chill and then I don't know if you want to go to the beach or no it feels really cold <laughs> <laughs> and the settle hates being cold. She hates yeah, being in cold. In the morning? Yeah, like towards like in the morning. So you right now you just wanna chill there? Yeah, we can go have dinner. Okay. You guys and I'm actually gonna do a part two of the vlog because I already have like thirty minutes in, so I'm just gonna do a part two, so stay tuned for the part two. For this one I'm gonna upload it once I get home and then from there I'll do the part two. But for right now, we're just gonna chill and whenever I decide to vlog again, I'll pick up my phone, you guys.